In 2008, Hal Abelson taught a mobile computing course at MIT. And kind of his goal was to have the students explore this new mobile world that was you know, coming about. And you know, people are walking around with supercomputers, or in this case, driving around with a supercomputer in their hand. What does that mean for, for society? Uh, the problem was the students spent so much time learning Java, Objective-C, and kind of the code libraries for, for mobile that they didn't get enough time to really explore mobile technology. So Hal you know, took a two-year sabbatical at Google and went cross-country and teamed up with this great team of engineers at Google. And what they did was they created this language called App Inventor. And you know, kind of the idea with it is it's designed specifically for beginners. So you had these great engineers targeting and focusing on beginning programmers and built this library to be used by beginners. Um, so they created this language. It's easy to learn. You can quickly do prototyping and you can build complete apps. And the thing is, it's really fun, you know, because we, we love our phones, right? So what an incredibly motivating experience to, to be able to program them, to be able to tinker with them, you know, to be able to create software for them. Um, so App Inventor has been a great success. With App Inventor, programming is sort of like doing a puzzle. I can drag out a win texting.message receive block, and then I can program what the app should do when a text comes in. So let's say I want to auto-respond to text. Well, I can grab a texting.send message block and put it into the event handler. Of course, I need to specify what message I'm going to send, so I'll grab a set texting.message block, and then I'll enter some kind of message. In this case, I'll say, I'm driving, text you later. Finally, I need to specify who I'm going to send the text to. So I'll grab a set texting.phone number block. In this case, I want to send the text to the same number as the person that just texted me. So I'll grab a reference to this phone number, plug it into the texting dot, set texting.phone number block, and voila, I've got an app that auto responds to all texts coming in. I'm Dave Wilbur, and I'll be your host at appinventor.org. I teach at University of San Francisco, and I've been teaching AppInventor there for three years. We teach design majors, humanities majors, science majors. We teach all comers, and they're all beginners, and they've all had you know, very good success learning to build apps. Um, at AppInventor.org, you'll find the complete AppInventor book. This book was authored by myself, Hal Abelson, Ellen Spurtis, and Liz Looney, the engineers of the AppInventor team. You'll also find a bunch of screencasts. You know, pretty much I'll walk you through building each of the apps in the book and, and some other apps um, and step you through not only kind of how things work, but also kind of the computer science fundamentals behind each each app. Finally, there's a course in a box which you can follow. So this, this contains kind of conceptual um, questions, notes, a lot of materials that, from the class I teach at, at USF. So if you're a student, you can walk through this course in a box, and if you're a teacher, you can use the modules as you see fit in your own classroom. Thank you, and have fun building apps.